We uh, spent uh, four days uh, judging uh, general news, spot news, and uh, long-term project. Overall, we had, uh, and it's not a big surprise, we have a, a great number of stories, majority of the stories, uh, were on the migrant uh, refugees uh, in Europe. There is a big gap between that, those stories and the rest, the rest being Nepal, have a lot of the on the earthquake in Nepal. Uh, I think the third one would be what we saw quite a lot also is uh, attacks in Paris, uh, Charlie Hebdo in, in January and then uh, in, uh, in November. And then the rest is sort of uh, spread out quite a lot on China. There was that big explosion uh, uh, at the storage uh, not far from Beijing, we have a lot of those stories. We saw uh, overwhelming numbers of black and white on, on, the, on the single uh, long-term project. I, I like black and white, it's great, but I think its color is good too. I think photographers should uh, not think that, uh, you know, it, it's necessarily uh, an added value because it's, it's black and white. And, what I am, I am looking for in, uh, in that category, especially uh, news, has to uh, witness an important event. This is a world press photo, and uh, that's what I'm, I'm looking for. And then obviously you go, uh, a picture has to be strong, compelling, uh, has to go to work at different levels, being there, witnessing, and then it has to tell me something. We are going to enter uh, a stage uh, where we are going to confront more and, and debate uh, the other uh, chairs uh, who would join in the general jury. And I think it, it's going to be extremely interesting and, and, and uh, uh, I'm really looking forward to it.